the brown boys, the brown boys, the brown boys, we the brown boys, the brown boys, we the brown boys. We watched our president go over to Hawaii and tell these people about his car. <laughs> oh, yeah, I remember. This was Joe Biden brain dead ass. God forgive me for this, but this is Joe Biden brain dead ass. <laughs> yeah, I remember when my lake house caught on fire. And yeah, we were about to lose a cat. Yeah, that cat was about to scorch. And yeah, I was about to lose my guy, my nice car that was worth about $2 million. Oh yeah, it was tragic. I was about to lose that. And he's telling this to people who've not only lost their house, They've watched people burn to death. They've lost dogs, cats, people, people. They lost memories. They've lost pictures. They lost everything. And this idiot get up there and say a slogan. This is why I know we a joke now. We a joke to the rest of the world. All we are is some slogan of, we're gonna build back better. Some people in Hawaii were looking at him like, Man, if you don't take that bullshit back, you punk. How you gonna build back better when I lost my grandma? Can you build my grandma back? How you gonna build back better when my son burnt up? This cliche dumb shit. How you gonna build back better? You gonna build the table back again that I remember since I was a kid that me, mama, and the baby ate at, and now mama ain't here, the table ain't here, the house ain't here. How can you build me a new table to give me that memory again? So why would you say this dumbass build back better? Yeah, Hawaii is America, but we ain't sent as much money to Hawaii as we done to mother every other place. Ukraine got more money than Hawaii. Ukraine didn't get no build back better story. Ukraine got that money. Ukraine got that money. How you going to build back better when I done lost my whole family? I done lost, I, people done been burnt up by love. How you going to tell me a slogan? This ain't slogan time. I don't need a brain dead telling me some shit off a teleprompter. I need somebody with a heart. I need somebody with a heart to come talk to me. Not somebody that's reading off a AI computer. I need someone with a heart to come talk to me. But all we got is a brain dead motherfucker telling people we're going to build back better. Same shit he told us. Do it look like we built back better? <laughs> you niggas got more money in your pocket right now? I don't think you do. Ukraine getting all America dollars? Of course they are. And he going to run again. And he going to win again. Because everything now is about who we like. We like him. We don't give a f made a mistake. We like him. He's the safer choice. He makes us feel good. He can't even talk so he don't hurt our feelings. So we like him. It's all about who we f like. It's not about results no more. It's about who we like. Tell the truth. That's why all your pastors having sex with the congregation. This is why all the men are now just telling women what they want to hear because they know it's all about who we like. Nobody's trying to do right. Nobody's trying to do the right thing because why? It's too risky. It's too risky. If it's all about who we like, then I must stay in line with what you like. If I'm a pastor, I'm only going to preach about what you want to hear because it's what you like. If I'm a school teacher, I'm only going to give you so much because I don't want to upset you. Colin Flannery wrote a book, Do Not Make the Black Kids Angry. And I think that's what the government is doing with us. They're promising you just enough free shit so you don't get angry. Yeah. We'll give you loan forgiveness. We'll give you niggas something. We'll give you loan forgiveness. Uh, we'll give you goddamn some more welfare. We'll bid you some more project. Just don't get mad, nigga. We'll give you a stimulus check. We're not going to give you consistent jobs or financial freedom or 
the same type of education, but we'll give you a little check to shut you the fuck up. Because we know woo, when you niggas get that money, we'll give you a little check to shut you the hell up. So you don't know what to vote for. You don't know how to vote. The only thing you know is who to be mad at, who you like. When you ask somebody what you voting for, what you like, oh, I don't know. I don't like him. I didn't like my motherfucking oil who did my brakes and who uh, did my filters. I didn't like them because I didn't know them. And nor did I give a fuck about knowing them or liking them. I was just looking for the motherfucker who could do the job. Can you do the job? That's all I'm looking for. We're not looking for people who get the job done. We're looking for people who we like. And that's why I don't give a fuck about liking nobody. I give a fuck about if you useful in a room. If you're not useful in a room, please don't come around me. You're going to take away from me. You're going to be looking for me to do something for you that you're not willing to do yourself. You're going to take away from me. And a lot of you right now are in friendships, relationships, all kinds of ships that you think this person loves you. And they just want to take away from you. The only reason why you're around them is so they can take away from you. The moment you don't serve that purpose of allowing them to take away from you, they will get the f away from around you. So don't give people shit. If you want to see the real person, don't give them nothing. Don't give them nothing.